As a small child, I used to like to play model soldiers, but I got fed up with little static plastic figures. So I started to make soldiers out of plasticine so I could have battles with them. I went from a few to ending up making hundreds of little plasticine soldiers, having a battle, rolling them up, and then making another hundred or so until they fell to pieces again. So I was fairly used to making little figures. Some years later, I told a friend that I'd been to the model village at Babacombe. He went down, saw them, and said that I had told him to come. The owner turned around and said, oh, what did he think of the model village? Referring to me. And my friend Pete said he thought it was brilliant, but he thought your little figures were lousy. And the owner of the model village, a man called Tom Dobbins, said I should go down and talk to him. He said, did I think I could do better figures? And I said I'd give up if I couldn't. And since then, I mean, that's 40, 50 years ago. And for that model village and other model villages in this country and abroad and museums, I've made something in the region of 22 to 23,000 individual little figures of this size. You can get fed up with making little model village figures. As nice as they are, there comes a limit. So I have made other styles of figures. Some are of the model village type, others are larger. They've been made for museums, exhibitions, uh, private sale, all sorts of things. I occasionally go bigger figures, sometimes smaller ones. It just depends on what people want. Other things I do are commission. Somebody wants a figure. So yes, I've made a lot of figures for a lot of different things, a lot of different people. Um, sometimes I just make them to be humorous. These are very much model village figures just for the sheer hell of it, really. I had a teapot that was being thrown out. I do tend to use rubbish when rubbish is available. It's very hard to say what an individual figure, how long an individual figure takes to make because I've inevitably, if I'm doing figures, I've got several on the go at the same time. So they tend to come out in batches.